because I really wasn't in love with anything today. I, I like Walmart higher. It's probably going to go. Um, but out of complete nowhere came this Cheesecake Factory. So, uh, long story short, let's just do this. Um, this is, again, short and Walmart's so long. I can flip to the Walmart. I mean, this is going to go today, probably. I don't know. I just, I want something really, really easy today, really, really fast, really, really quick. And it might be the Cheesecake Factory. Anyway, markets sold off really hard yesterday into the close. No reason, couldn't find anything, didn't make any sense. Why that did that on non-news. But again, the market's been screaming higher. And you can't fight it. You can't fight City Hall. Is this moving? 923. Any other ideas anybody wants me to look at quick? Got like three minutes here. Uh, Tesla, I do like, but it's taking its good old time. Uh, if you mean the SPY, there's nothing to do today in the market. There's no trade in the market today, if that's what you're asking me, Don. Market was up. Then it was down, then it was up, then it was down. Basically, this is technically up, but it's pretty much neutral. There's really no play here in the market today. I don't think anyone should go long the market here today. And you certainly can't short the market. I don't know. This Walmart might be easier than cake. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I know I'm doing an open house today, but today might not be an easy day to follow me because I like two things, and one's a long and one's a short. <laughs> so, again, Walmart's a long, cake is a short. You know, they might both go, but I only want to do one thing today. Will Tessa finally go today? One can only hope, but... I waited all day yesterday. The move yesterday in the morning was the move on that, and that was it, which has been indicative of everything we've been dealing with. But there's no play in the market today. How can you short this here? We're just screaming higher. But it's very difficult to go long at this point as well. I just have no interest in trading the market right now whatsoever at all. That's why we have to do selective things. Selective things are working. And again, if the market does want to sell off today, maybe today's the day for Disney. I did look at that earlier. Disney looks good. Sitting here waiting any second. Uh, the queues are up, though. Queues are up more than the SPY. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Walmart long or cake short? That's it. Anything, anybody want me to look at anything else quick? You got 30 seconds here. If you don't want to do anything today, you don't have to do anything. I don't think today's the day to get crazy. And anything I do today, I'm not going to be holding it long. Again, market's right on the cusp. I think it looks a little frothy to me, but you can't short this market. You just can't do it. It's, a, it's crazy. The only thing crazier than shorting this market at this point would be to trade in any of those Reddit stocks, which are which look like a disaster today. And gosh, people are losing money left and right in those. I was on TV about it a couple days ago. I don't think my I don't think my uh, assistant posted it yet, actually. We're doing day trades here, Don. If I do a trade here and I call it, it's a day trade. It's a trade on margin. Oh, let's 
just, just watch Walmart. This could, could be easier. easier. I do this any flurry up and I'm going to be out. Cake needs to get going first. Cake needs more volume. Cake needs to open. Cake needs to do something. Cake is, is it open or is it not open? No one should be leaning on the keyboards today. I think this cake is open, but man, is it thin. Let's quick look at aim at. That was the other watch. This is going to be a wild and wooly beast, though. Aim at higher, but it's going to be wild. Wild and spready. I'm not sure if this is open because it looks really weird. It's either open and really thin or it's not open. Does anybody know? Is it just me or does it look weird? It looks really weird if it's open though. It's not moving right now. too weird to me. All right, back around to Walmart. Stop's going to be 63.50. Let's do 20 by 50. Walmart long. That's it. One push up and done. This isn't a bad entry. Amat's going to be really crazy. Walmart's going to be easier. 20 is valid. There, do it if you want it right now. Get the stop and put it at 50. One flurry up, 64.50, 64.75, 65. When we get there, I don't know, I don't care. Here we go, Walmart, 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 one quick trade. I should, I'm gonna set my alarm. I'm just gonna set it because all week, I said, we're gonna get out of everything fast and then I hold everything to the piggy target all week. I'm gonna set my alarm for 9.40. Literally, I just said it here. Because the entire week we said it. And then it was pigger, 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 pigger. I mean, Tasa yesterday was ridiculous. Here we go. Walmart up. Up and up and over. So yesterday's high was 41, 42 ish. Let's look at the market quick. Again, Walmart's on its own. Walmart's on its own. Tesla, if you dare. I don't think I can go after this again today. I just don't think I can. I want to. I'm thinking about it. I thought about it. What happened to the cake? No, I think cake is too, too thin, not trading right, and too weird. 
All right, here we are, back to the Walmart. Remember, longs take a long time. So you gotta let them wiggle and jiggle and wiggle and jiggle. If you didn't do it, you could do it right again in here at 20. Stop is 63.50, that's more than enough room. Whatever the market wants to do, it wants to do. Time of the day is 9.34. I'm not gonna do anything with the same ad. The other one that I did like, that I absolutely loved last night, that completely and totally reversed was T2. T2 was a good gap last night. And then it got worse and worse and worse and worse and worse as the morning went on. And then of course, it flipped. So I'm in Walmart long and you gotta be careful here. Make sure you have the stop in, there was nothing else to do. Cake's too thin, aim at is ridiculous. And again, mark, it looks like it's gonna fall, but will it? Will it fall? I'm not gonna give this any more room because if it hits me out, it could go all the way down, break 63 and flip around, I'll just do a retake. I think 50 is enough room for now. Well, we could give it 20. Let's move, let's move it to 20. I don't know if anybody did this with me. Put it at 63.20. I don't do anything with that at all, Don. <laughs> so, no idea what you're even talking about. Don't use anything like that. Stop is 62320. I'll go back and look at the cake, but I think it's too thin. We get another setup in this we can add in the Walmart. I watched this yesterday. I, we should have done this yesterday. By the time I said, you know what? This looks good. This looks great. It was already going. It was like too late of an entry, too late in the day, too late to deal with it. I said, you know what? I'll just watch it tomorrow. So let's look at everything here. Cake is a bust just because it was too thin. The spread has tightened up. It's kind of a waste of a gap because it's too thin. Maybe it's because it happened too late. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Aim at, again, I don't want to do this because it's too wild and too crazy. And Walmart I like. So we're in this. It's a little bit snaily, but that's okay. You want to do it, you can do it here. I'm not going to add in this because I gave it more room, at least not at this point. I don't think I'm going to be getting out of this now at 9.40. Let me set my alarm to 10. You might need 20 minutes to get this up. Here we go, Walmart. So apparently a lot of people are shopping at Walmart. High income earners are shopping at Walmart. I don't know, I read something about that. I don't even think there is a Walmart in New York. Last time I was in a Walmart was like 25 years ago. <laughs> and, and I don't think I'd even go to a Walmart. I prefer Targets, I think Targets are cleaner. Every Walmart I've ever been in has been so dirty and so difficult to find anything. Can't ever, can't ever find anything, and you can't ever find anyone to help you find anything. So here's the market. It's not gonna fall. Let's look at the video. The video is out next week. That's gonna be the big one. Could go up to a thousand. Could fail. Crash the market. Don't think it can happen. It could. Everybody thinks this is higher, but it might not be. Again, I'm not trading this into the earnings. We're probably a million dollars for these calls. Probably a billion. So we're in a little stale baby here at Walmart. People order it online and have stuff delivered. Let's 
looks good. good. Good for them. Good for the people. Good for the people. Here, I was a couple people late. Here we go. Walmart, Walmart, wah ha ha, Walmart. If you didn't do it, you can do it now. You could wait till it hits again. 6410, I think, is okay. So we're ending the week going long. Sell and main go away is a complete and total lie. <laughs> Obviously. So it is what it is. Uh, we can look at Amazon. I didn't look at that this morning. Show again. Longs or snails, that's why I prefer to short. We can check on Disney. Disney looks good. Disney looks great. Disney looks really good, actually. This is almost tempting to do even here, even now. So we could add in the Walmart, but not yet. We could add in it, get one quick flurry and out. That's what we could do. Instead of trying to hold it up to 65. What happened with cake? That's just a waste. Let's go we didn't do it. We stuck it in here. It doesn't even look like it's moving. It's like a waste of a gap. That's a shame. T2 flipped again, very, very messy. And market is nowhere well. Just refuses to fall. It refuses to fall. Even if it falls, it's probably going to get bought somewhere. Let's look at Tessa. Oh, this just isn't ready. All right, here we go. One push up to Walmart. We did not get up over yesterday's high. As soon as we do, we're going to get a flurry, and then we're going to get out. Whether you take it or you don't take it or you did nothing today, there really was not much to do. I looked extremely hard. The longer I have to search for something to do, that just tells you, take it easy. I felt like that all week. If you didn't do the Walmart, you could do it right here. We get out at 6410, and then who cares where it goes. at 64.10. Something made the market sell off yesterday late, but I couldn't find it. But market didn't care about it today. I show up with or without the market. Market's going nowhere as well today. We, we literally could have done nothing, but we didn't do Walmart yesterday. And then I was like, gosh darn it. And really wasn't ideal though in the morning. And so this was really on my radar today. Although I would have preferred T2, but T2 flipped and then it wasn't good. Then it was a bust. I mean, this is a bus. Good. Look at that. Thank God we didn't do it. Is Tessa actually going to fall with the mark in here? <laughs> Disney looks good. Disney looks great. Disney is very tempting. Disney is extremely interesting. I just don't want to do more than one thing. 
But if for some reason we get stopped at Walmart, we could do Disney. I don't think we're gonna. I don't think we're gonna. This looks great. Look at what the market's doing. I think we're gonna be okay here at 9.44. Again, shorts are so much faster, so much quicker, so much easier to trade than longs, but really this was the only thing I felt like didn't care about the market today and didn't really go the way I wanted it to yesterday, but was good, but it didn't really do it all yesterday, so... can do it at 64.10 if you didn't. Again, stops 20. And you could add there if you want or just leave what you have. I don't even care what I make in this as long as we can get out of this fast. This market's too sketchy here. Too sketchy. And we need to end the week on a good solid positive green note here you go 6410 if you want to do it or add in the walmart don you're funny i don't do any of those things that that sounds like that's don is talking about all kinds of things like tweezers tweezers is i tweeze my eyebrows <laughs> i don't use tweezers for trading how funny 6410 wonder how many people have margin calls with that once they took around once they took off them the they disallowed margin on those stocks earlier in the week probably a lot of people got caught in those trades because then they had to put up money here you go add to the walmart if you want it if you want it here we go let's pay attention 9:46. let's go i think if we can get it up over 41 we're gonna get a nice push probably goes to 65 or beyond not that i'm gonna hold it to there it's actually a decent day in New York. We've had rain every single solitary day this week. No sunshine. The sun is actually shining as I speak at 947. It would be nice to go out for a park walk for the first sunny day in five days. Let's go Walmart. Let's do it. So we have a number out at 10 o'clock. That's a long way away from now. Market refuses to fall. It's not a big number. It's, I don't think it affects much. I don't think there's anything really that's going to happen today that's going to affect much. So you say, well, what's the market going to do? If it's going to fall, why? Nothing's going to happen that's going to make it fall. And I think it's in a tough spot here to rally. No play here in the market today. We're doing selective things. You could be in the Walmart. You could have done it. You could have done the ad. You could be waiting. Cake I washed, thought maybe we get a play in it. This is setting up. If you feel like you want to get crazy, you can do the cake, but it's hardly moving, and I think the volume's low, but it did set up, and it's trying to go, and it could drop a dollar, and I don't know. I opted not to do this. I thought it was strange. I couldn't even figure out if it was open. It was just too thin, and then it wasn't moving, and even now it seems too thin. Aim at, we didn't do. T2, we didn't do. Disney is going to do something soon. I don't know if it's today or next week, but that's getting ready. And the same thing with Tesla. And Tesla could be today. This is really trying to go, though. It really wants too badly, but it's not ready. And if it is next week, so that's probably going to be the do or die for the market. We're in a snail. Oh, we might be in it for another 15, 20 minutes. Any questions from anyone about anything at all? It was really a boring morning and a boring day, and there wasn't much to the downside, even though I preferred a short. Didn't end up doing the Disney or the Tesla. They were watches. 
no good earnings whatsoever at all. This is a continuation of yesterday's earnings in Walmart, and it might actually do it today. And even if the market falls today, I think this is going to be a-okay. I wouldn't trade the market today, Don. I don't think it moves enough to make any money. GME. Most days the market has no play. I don't know why people love to trade futures because of the leverage, but most days in the market, there's no play to do. GME. Wow, oh, this thing looks horrific. Let's look at it quick. So it's as if Monday never occurred. That guy came out and tweeted, made the gap. It's as if this never even happened. Can you believe that? You can believe it, actually. You can 100% believe it. Yeeks. Meta, what about it? I haven't looked at this, not in this. What do you, what's your question? Meta is never fell right on the earnings. Rally with the market. Could this fall today? Maybe. Again, everything is right on the cusp, but nothing wants to go. So that's the situation. You can get all the people in the world. <laughs> you can all, everybody can jump in a certain stock. You saw that with the, the mean stocks. If institutional money isn't going to buy it or sell it, it's not going to go anywhere. And the problem with the market right now is there's no, there's no nobody wants to sell. So the market isn't falling because you know, you know, everyone that's long the market, no institutions want to sell right now. It's a wait and see what happens here with interest rates. I personally don't think they're going to lower rates this year at all. But they will continue to allow the market to believe that they will. But, again, to go long here doesn't make really any sense either. And technically, you know, we were neutral but up a little bit today. I think we're going to get this going by 10. 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. Everybody knows Gerard that helps him with the rum. Some of you do, some of you don't. He decided he wants to, you could get in this if you didn't do it. Again, this is a long, 6410 Walmart. He decided he wants to get, like, make honey and buy bees. He's, like, literally driving in his car right now with 10,000 bees in it. <laughs> And a queen bee, he helps me with the room sometimes. He's a former student. But anyways, he helps out in the room if I take a day off or whatever. Anyways, he decided he, he wants to become like a beekeeper or whatever. So we ordered these special bees and he went to pick them up. And he, had, he built a house for the bees and the whole thing. He's like basically going to have probably delicious homemade honey. Um, I don't know how long it takes to make the honey, to get the honey with the bees, but you gotta have a queen and you gotta have all these bees and it's a whole thing. He's had to take a test. He had to take a test to get, I guess, license or something where he lives to have the bees on the property. Anyways, he's literally driving in a car with a mask on because he's worried, you know, he's worried about the bees even though they're in a container and uh, I'm like, oh my God, you have to send me a picture when you get home with this. Local honey is great for allergies. Yeah, it's supposed to be very good for you. 
it's it's supposed to be a good sugar substitute. There's so many sugar substitutes nowadays that are chemical substitutes. Like a sweetener substitute, I mean. Yeah, but it's a healthy sugar. Anyways, I can't even picture what 10,000 bees look like. 64, 34, 64, 41. We're going to fall asleep. Tesla, Tesla, does it want to do it? Will it do it? It's so tempting here, isn't it? You just want to do it. So we're in a snail, but snails aren't bad. There's nothing wrong with a snail. Nothing at all. 9.55 and we're waiting on this market to push up. Again, depending where you did this, 64.20, 64.10, whatever you did with this, make sure you have the stop in, 63.20. It's really a good entry here. All we need is some nice extension on this and a push and we're almost there. Time of the day is 9.55. One flurry up and I'm going to be out of the Walmart and call it a week. Even though the Tesla looks really good. Tesla looks... Tesla wants me to short it, but... Here we go, Walmart. I don't think there is a Walmart in New York. That, that doesn't seem possible. you think there would be one. Here we go. Walmart. We're getting it going. Who's in the Walmart? Let's go. New York City's too fancy for Walmart. Oh, there's targets everywhere. Everything's locked up. <laughs> now they have a thing where you press a button. CBS has it now. You have to press a button for the person to come to let you get your thing out that you want. It's like, welcome to the new world order where everything is locked because of crime. Here we go, Walmart. So we gotta get out of this soon, very, very soon. So the keys are probably falling because of NVIDIA. Although Apple looks great. Here we go. This is it. We got to do it right now. 41 is yesterday's high. Be wonderful Monday morning to get back into a groove. Short, 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 short. There was just nothing that looked good today. The short, I mean. That's an indie season. I don't really play those. Here we go, Walmart. Here. If you didn't do it, you can still do it. It's soon going to be too late to do it. Here we go. One push up and Walmart. And a flurry up. Here it goes. It's going to go. Well, I wanted an easy train on a Friday. It took a long time, but it still, it still is easy. We're going to get out of this soon. Again, I don't want to contend with this market on a Friday. In fact, we probably go nowhere today. There's no play in this market today. Probably shows no directional bias whatsoever. It's not going to sell off. It's not going to rally over yesterday's high. It's going to go nowhere. And we may go nowhere until next week with really Nvidia, unless we have some data out, which I can look at a little bit here. But somebody from the Fed could talk. Something could happen. Otherwise, next week is all about NVIDIA. So 
So we're going green here in the Walmart. Any questions from anyone about anything at all? Good. And here to the week, to go into the weekend. And refresh for next week. Here we go. Five more cents is all we need and we should get a flurry. It was a good call. I'm glad I did it. This is... I, I, the cheesecake... The cheesecake I would have perfectly been happy doing, but it was too thin. It worked. It absolutely did work. It was just way too thin. Here we go. Push, 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 push. Let's go. This is it. Walmart. Oh, we're not getting out of it yet. It's just starting to go. Here we go. Let it rip. While I can make money going long, and I am right now, I definitely prefer to short. I definitely prefer to short. Memorial Day is the following Monday. Not this Monday, but next Monday. Here we go. Push. Walmart. Let it go. Let it push, push, push up. Come on, Walmart. Let's get going. Time of the day is 10.01. Long to like paint drying sometimes it is, it's true. When they painted my apartment when I first moved in here two years ago, my apartment's so hot because I face towards the sun. And the paint dried so fast. Forty-eight is a baby. So I'm still in it. You, if you want to be done with it, you can get out. You could get out right there. You can get out right now. I'm trying to get a flurry. A flurry is more than a couple pennies. A push. But she could be out. Time of the day is 10.01. Give it a video. Looked like it was going to fall. It's not. And Apple looks good. And here we are, Walmart. Let's get it up. Over 50. And a push wherever we go. And I'm going to be out. We can do it. We got super close. And this is a nice trade here with the little ad we did. All's well that ends well. 48. today was easy. Again, wasn't the short we like to do, but easy in the sense that we did one and we're going to be done soon. AMD long. I've been waiting for a sell-off in AMD, to be honest with you, but I will look at it for you today. I, I, I don't have a bullish bias on this. So I, you said you're in it long. I think this has a drop coming. It's falling today, but... I was waiting for a sell-up in this, to be honest with you. 
Well, I don't like that long. If you're looking for an entry to go long, I would, I would be waiting. It's not today. Here we go, Walmart. I had a tough time finding things that I wanted to go long this week. Everything we did go long this week worked. But I had a really tough time finding the things I wanted to go long. I was picking and choosing and choosing and picking. You just can't go long everything just because the market's at the highs. Well, I don't do pullbacks, Don. 48, 47. If we could just get this over 50 or anywhere with a flurry. Time of the day is 10.05. The market's not going to go anywhere today. Tesla? I don't know. It's just not ready. Everything looks the same. Everything almost looks the same when you look at it. Seriously. We're lucky this is even moving at all. Market isn't going to go anywhere today at all. So when we get out of this, we're done. And again, you could be out of this. You literally could have. I said I wanted a flurry. This really isn't a flurry yet, but 10.06. Especially with NVIDIA earnings next week, you got to be really careful doing anything like AMD right now. What if NVIDIA is down? on the earnings. Here we go, Walmart. Here we go, over 50, let's go. Jeez, this is like, whew. One penny, two penny, three penny, four. We touched 50, this is so funny. 51. I'm going to get out of this soon. This is like... That's a nice trade with the ad. Watch, I'll get out of it and it'll run right up to 67. <laughs> I'll get out of it here and then it'll rip up two to bucks. Typical, 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 fit, here we go, 52. 53. Here we go, Walmart. Actually, I'll be happy if I can get out of this in the 60s. Let's see if we can get it there. Or should we just get out here? 1008, 1008. The last Ooh. time we did a snail, I forget. Of all, but I don't think it does. I don't think it does, and I think Walmart's on its own, but I don't want to trade all day for five cents, ten cents, fifteen cents, twenty cents. You could be out of the Walmart. If this doesn't push over the high here, I think I'm going to get out too. I, I think this is a nice trade though. 
I think it's. I think the option is going to be a heck of a lot easier to navigate, though, because you're staring here and waiting for it to go penny by penny. And it was a nice little trade. There was nothing else to do. If we hadn't done this, we would have done nothing today. And actually, with the ad, this is a nice little trade on a Friday morning. But I don't want to hold this for another hour for ten more cents. So see if we can get it up. I think it was 53. No, 54. I don't know what you mean by too big to differ from the market. I don't know what you mean by too big. I don't think the market goes anywhere today. That's one of the reasons why there really wasn't much to do. If we had the market's help in anything today to the downside, then it would have been a lot easier to come up with short plays and there just wasn't anything really good. Again, Kate went for a quick little trade, a tiny little trade in here, but it opened weird and thin and really, really strange. And even now it looks weird. So again, when you have the market with you, it's a lot easier to find plays. Of course, you gotta read the market direction right. Sometimes the market gaps down and flips. Sometimes the market gaps down and falls. I have no conviction the market's going to go anywhere today. In fact, it probably looks right now at 10.10, exactly how it's going to close at 4 o'clock. Like whatever this is right here, a little baby red, a little baby green, a little baby butt. It's probably what it's going to look like. I don't think anyone's going to dump this market and sell it off unless something happens or somebody talks from the Fed or somebody. And I don't think anything's on top to happen today. So you could get out of the Walmart here, or you could still be in it. Is anyone in this with me? Monday, I don't know. Monday's a long way away. I don't know what happens Monday. You go out and make money. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, everything made new highs. Again, BA ended up rallying because the diamonds made new highs. That's why BA flipped and then rallied as much as it did. But the banks were strong. The banks have been strong and that helped lift the SPY. Apple rallied. That was the one thing we did do long that worked in our favor. Here I am sitting in this again, waiting for it to go up. Sitting and sitting and sitting. What you could do is you could put the stop at break even. I should have just got out of this at 50 to call it a fast day and gone to walk in the park. Gone to walk in the park. So let's look at the spy because Walmart's with the spy. So again, sell and may go away did not happen this month. We've got less than two weeks left in the month, basically a week and a half with the holiday and this and that and the other thing. Some earnings are out in the next week. The video is one of the big ones, but long story short, it was an unusual, I don't trade based on cycles of seasons, but this was a very, very strong month of May for the market. I didn't anticipate it. I didn't think it would happen. I didn't think it would make new highs, but we did. So again, the reason the market is rallying is because of things that interest rates are on the way down. And I don't think that's the case, but it doesn't matter what I think. It matters what the market thinks. The market thinks that they're going to lower interest rates once or twice between now and the end of the year, and the market is just reacting constantly, constantly to that. Everything the Fed says, every single media, every single data point. We get bad data, the market rallies. We get good data, the market falls. I mean, it's just, you know, and then we never really fall. So, again, we're not going to go anywhere today, up or down. So hard to see where we would be on Monday and we're not in anything with the market because it doesn't make sense. It's a waste of time. I'm in this Walmart and I'm waiting for it to go and I think it's going to be easier to do with the option to just let it rip and ride. Fast trade was got at 50. That was my plan of action. I wanted it to ding up and then it went poop and then it went down and I could still get out here with money. And I'm debating and it's 10.15 and I don't want to hold this all day. And now I might have to hold it all day, which is a pain in the butt. But it was a nice little tiny trade. We did it early, then we did the ad. We gave it more room, but didn't even need it. Didn't even need it. 
Uh, the market isn't going to hurt this today. The market's not going to help this today. The market's not going to do anything today at all. And so we're just waiting on the Walmart. I didn't do this. I thought about doing this. Yesterday I missed my exit in this. That was good. And again, I still think this falls. I don't know when. Right now today it's rallying. It's trying to lift. It's 10.14. If this decides to rally today, this could actually push up the market. But we're lucky we even found this. Look at how there was nothing today. Any questions from anyone about anything at all? Did anyone do the Walmart? Did anyone get out? One person got out. And market did make new highs this week. And everyone needs to see why. There's no reason. <laughs> no reason at all. You would have thought with the market rally this week that the Fed actually lowered rates this week. You would have thought. There's no reason whatsoever at all for the market to have made new highs. But you can't short it. Anyone still in this with me? Or am I by myself? Here goes the Walmart. It's a sale. James got out. No rate hikes. Who said no rate hikes? Thank God that would sell off the market like crazy. They actually hiked. The sun's really out. Looks like a nice day. How did I get stuck in this thing? I thought we were headed towards a recession a year ago, but we never did. Everyone keeps saying the economy's strong. Everyone meaning the administration. Every time we get a number, it's strong, 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 strong. And then they revise the numbers worse. That's happening far too often as well. But Walmart laid people off. Stock gapped up. It's running up. We're along it. So it's like, look at all the Apple had to buy back. If you look at what's went on even in earnings season this quarter, you're like scratching your head. So... I'm making no predictions if we have a recession or don't. The real estate market would have to crash for something like that to happen, and probably on the unemployment rate would have to really spike up over 4%. Well over 4%. I don't know if it's going to happen. I don't want a recession. But that's nothing to do with the market. And we're going to go long and we're going to go short. It doesn't matter. Either way. Here we go. I'm going to get out of this Walmart soon. I'm going to get a chance. One more push up. This was a 
Texas now. It's a nice little tree. We might ever get it up in the 60s here. Let's see. Just have to be patient. I prefer to get out so fast and quick and be done, but... We're lucky we did this today. I think if we had done anything else, we wouldn't have made out as well as we did with this, that's for sure. And Cake would have made me nervous the way it was trading. Didn't like it. AMAT was a mess. T2 was a mess. Market's a mess. Here we go. Again, one thing is all we need. One good trade a day. That's all we need. One thing, one thing, one. Here we go. 47, 48. One penny, two penny, one penny, boom. Anyway, somebody had a party on the roof, unauthorized hired a photographer and the photographer had a drone to take pictures of the party the drone went a wall off the roof smashed into the building damaged the building big time here we go walmart and uh the building didn't even know it then i guess the city checks out and takes pictures of the building and things and here we go walmart and the city sent the building something showing the damage to the building that had to be fixed, the glass and the window. And it still hasn't been fixed. And now so there's this huge damage to the building because somebody had a photographer and, and had a drone out. Can you believe it? And the drone damaged the building. And the building wouldn't have even known. I mean, structurally, it's important for these things. I guess the city... I, I didn't know the city did that. I knew they do those things where they go around and they check like the, the firmadents for the brick buildings to make sure that they're stable. But I guess they do it with all the buildings, glass or the brick ones. Anyways, these drones are out of control. So I, I was like, oh my gosh, I don't know if they can go after the photographer or the people that had the unauthorized party for it, for the damage, but it's gonna be very expensive and now there's this huge thing on the street because the glass is broken and people are out of control with these drones all right i'm still in it 53 54 yeah i could have got out there it hit 50. again this is the thing about longs It just takes so long. So here's the market. It's a fake aroma. Fake and lower, and then now it's going to fake higher. It's going to fake, fake, fake. There is some significant stuff next week. Again, but the big thing is NVIDIA. But that's not till Wednesday. I think it's Wednesday night or Wednesday morning or... I don't know, I have to look. 22nd, but it's the 22nd. 22nd's Wednesday. Until then, the market may go nowhere, though, to be honest with you. Market actually might wait till Wednesday to do anything until NVIDIA. I have to look and see what econ is out Monday and Tuesday. I am gonna get out of this soon, though. Sitting in this for an hour. And the park is calling. The birds are calling. Here we go, Walmart. Here we go. The videos are after the hours? Yeah, well then we could go nowhere for three days. Nowhere did, four days. Nowhere today, nowhere Monday, nowhere Tuesday, nowhere Wednesday. Literally, the market could go nowhere until Thursday. I really am going to get out of 
out of this soon. soon. Good morning. Good morning. Have a good day today. Sunny day. Supposed to get up to 70. I have patience is second to none. I, I don't consider myself a patient person, but I think I've grown more patient over the years. But I typically am an impatient person, which is why I prefer to short. Again, if someone said you could make money in five minutes versus an hour, you'd always choose five minutes. Also, the faster you get in and out of a trade, the less you're at the mercy of the market. Today was a wash. Again, I said the market would go nowhere today, so I wasn't worried. The market wasn't going to hurt this today, or it wasn't going to help this today. I really am going to get out of this soon, though. I can get out of this right now. I'm glad I did the ad. The video fell. I don't know why. Now it's flipping. And here goes Walmart making another new high. 52, 53, 54. You can count every penny. I'm going to have to get out of this in a flurry. Because if I wait, it'll drop down. Boop. And then I'll... Be like, why didn't I get out of it there? <laughs> I could have sold 10 birds in the time that this went. London Club starting. I don't really pay attention to that, but if you do, I still don't think it affects the market. <laughs> I don't think the market goes anywhere today. Here we go. Hand to the button, Walmart flurry up. I'm glad we did this today. Here, 54. Ah, I'm out. I'm done. I am not going to deal with this going back in the 30s. That is it. Again, if you have the patience to hold it, I think it's a lot easier to do as an option. It's higher. It's higher. I just, I'm not going to sit all day in this. Anyways, good job. Everyone should be up. Everyone should have made money in this. Let's quick look, look, look at the market. Mm. Oh, there's Galahad. Did you do it? Again, this is one of these things where I think the market really could wait until NVIDIA. But again, no one knows what a video is going to do. I wouldn't be surprised either way. I wouldn't be surprised if it crashes. I wouldn't be surprised if it gaps up over a thousand. Galahad made money. Very good. Any questions from anyone about anything at all? Here it is. It's going to run right up now. It'll go to 68 today now that I got out. <laughs> but I think it's a lot easier to be in the calls. So we did the Walmart calls. Hold them. This is on its own. Very good. Have a great weekend, everyone. You're welcome.